This vlog is going to be my hours, my days, whatever you want to call it, in Nashville, Tennessee. I'm taking my mom for her 20-something birthday um, so that we could go ahead and go have fun because, you know, she haven't gone out in a while. I'm going to go take her to do some fun stuff. Corey just got our bag. Um, I'm going to update y'all when we get through the security stuff because our flight starts boarding at 7.50 and it is currently... 640 and I don't know how busy it's gonna be. Mom, mom on the first vlog. <laughs> it's my birthday. Wait, you have to say it on the vlog. It's my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. So let us get settled in the airport. I haven't been to this airport in a while and I don't really know how it works. And I will chat with you guys in a few. You know, me and Corey with our matching go yards. Oh, that man was in my video. Hello. Okay, so we are now waiting to board. We're too early, but me and Corey are gonna try to find something to eat. So we're waiting to board, so I'll let you always know when we start boarding. Don't touch me, unhand me. So we are now boarded on the plane. Our takeoff is at what time, Mom? Like 8, 8.20 or so. It is currently 8.10, we leave in 10 minutes. Me and Corey have a little um, breakfast from Starbucks, and then we have some water. And of course, I brought my Stanley. Oh, my seat, my seat belt on. Yes, it is. We're about, <laughs> we're about to take off, and when we take off, I will talk to you guys on the plane while everybody sleeps, so they can't hear me talking to you. Raise your hand. She said hi. Hi, Zero. Long eyes arms. Stop it, Corey. I'm a four year old. <laughs> but she wanted to dance. But she wanted to dance, right? She's on my sandwich. She wanted to dance, but she didn't want to tell everybody what's her birthday. <laughs> We're about to take off. We're off the plane. In the back. We're off the plane. And this airport is so big. They have so many restaurants, so many bars. It's huge. And I promise you, we've been walking for like three minutes so far to baggage cleaning. We're just now getting to baggage cleaning. It's been a long time. Kind of the Broadway experience, but with like less it breaks two lanes. Again. Welcome to me. Let me tell you about my experience so far. So once again, taking another trip, I cannot rent a freaking car. I'm still having problems renting a car. Why are we still having problems renting a car? So it's under me. I just so happen to lose my license. They can't take a picture. You can't take a picture. You can't take my passport or nothing. So we try, the lady wasn't even trying to be helpful. I, I'm like, we need to figure something out because I'm not about to be sitting up here spending the money on the car and you're not trying to do anything about it. You're just trying to push me to the side and get to the next person. No, I'm not leaving this desk till you figure something out and we exhaust all of our options. So I said, let's switch it over to Corey. We try to switch it over to Corey. Corey doesn't have a credit card still to this day. Why don't you have a credit card? Please help me understand why you don't have a credit card. So we couldn't do that and it was just a big mess once again with the car rental companies i'm done with these car rental companies i'm about to start going through these sketchy little people to do my car rental stuff but we are now in the hotel i had to spend 40 something dollars on an uber to get to this damn hotel so now we're gonna have to uber everywhere so now i have to redo all my expenses and everything because we have to spend money on uber instead of just getting a car they should have just gave me the car. It wasn't that serious. I couldn't even use my credit card under Corey's name because they said it has to match up. It's not that serious. Like, just take the freaking credit card. And the credit card he does have, they do not accept. Why do we always have these problems? But we're in the hotel room now. Everybody's about to get settled. Um, that ruins my plans for breakfast this morning. I was trying to go to breakfast this morning, but unfortunately we're missing breakfast because they want to cause all these problems. And mind you, we're standing in this line for like 25 minutes because there's one service associate and the other one's wandering around walking back and forth for what? So yeah, so now we're in the hotel room. So let me show you the hotel room. 
As you can see, we've already gotten a little comfy. It's actually a good size hotel room. It's not a bad size. So we are going to get redressed. We're gonna chill, get redressed, and figure out somewhere else to eat because I'm the only one that has planned everything out. Nobody actually knows what we're doing. So yeah, but that's what I'm gonna do. Between Monique and Corey, I don't know who's gonna drive me insane first. Don't be using my bingo. That's not even, is it? Is that, that where you got it from? Chat later, and I told you that, and you still oh. see it. <laughs> We're about to leave, so this is the first outfit check. So cute, so country girl, so country city girl. Mm -hmm. Earrings, necklace, cute little charm necklace. Mm -hmm. And then red purse. Red boots. This is Corey's OOTD. Let's get accessories first. So cute. He's about to take his dreads out. Lift up the sh lift up your um, arms. You can see we did a little belt look all the way down to the docks. So cute. Happy Cheers birthday! To 44. Yay. I got you on 43. Yeah. Um, we just made it to, I guess, like downtown, their version of downtown. Oh, this is crazy. Um, but we're about to go eat because I'm super hungry because we have an event at four. I scheduled it for four. Luckily, I scheduled it out because I kind of had a feeling we would be running late. Um, but it's super busy already. You said one more? This is where we're going. So we decided to set up the rooftop because we didn't even know there was a rooftop. So let me show you the view of the rooftop. Uh, that's so cute how the sign moves and we can see pretty much everything. Oh, you guys are ladies up. Oh, you guys are ladies up. Oh, you guys are birthday surprise activity on the way there we obviously are just walking there because it was like it was like a four minute walk we were trying to go to the walk of fame but i couldn't find it so i gave up Lip huh? guess what that is guess what we get to do today instinct I like it, but it's clear. On, yeah. me, on me, it's clear. You'll yeah. be able to see it more. Definitely darker. Mm -hmm. I definitely see that more than yeah. yeah. But we can try darker, but yeah. I do just, like this just one. Just to be clear. Okay. Why? Okay. Uh, it's our birthday today. It's our birthday so. today. Happy birthday. So just like birthday trip? Yeah. yeah. Birthday. I think I'm going to do this one. You like that one? I do mm -hmm. like this one. Okay. The fuchsia. The fuchsia, yeah, like that purple. That um, fuchsia color that Rihanna made really caught my eye. So. Purple. Mm -hmm. Definitely not purple. <laughs> <laughs> like lips look like I just had like a blue slushy or something. Like yeah. That. <laughs> I don't lady bomb. <laughs> 
It's so cute, Did you get a video on your phone? Yeah. I want to watch it. How it's made. I don't mean it. Oh, I see it. That's time. Hey, I was ready for earlier too. Big mama. Nobody's gonna know what that means except us. Oh, yeah. Us and Lotto. Yeah, that's so cute. Look, mom. That's so cute. Ah. It really smells like vanilla. So we just left the lip lab and now we're gonna go find a place to take pictures because our next, well, where we're gonna eat at is literally within this area. So there's no point in us going all the way back to the hotel, coming all the way back. It doesn't make sense to do. We're just gonna stay here, find somewhere to chill until our reservation. So the lip lab was super duper cool. It was a 10 out of 10, but right now we're literally just walking to see if I can find somewhere to take pictures at because I just look so plain in certain areas and it just doesn't look right. Um, yeah, so let me show you. So we're at the Empty Social. Um, it took us like maybe like 10 minutes to get here. Now we're gonna go inside and see if we can get inside early. Just drank and ate a small pizza. Now we're gonna go bar hop. Everybody's a little tipsy right now, but Corey's drunk. I'm tipsy. My mom is tipsy. But Corey's drunk. New day, new vibes. Everybody's dressed, ready to go. We don't really have that much planned today, but we're gonna figure something out. Uh, oops. So we're going to the museum, um, the Country Music Museum, because they have like four or five different museums out here, which are kind of cool. But the music one is like my mom's main interest, so that's where we're gonna go. And then we have like a a surprise activity after. It's not really an activity. It's just like a a good little experience, I guess you could say. Pretty much it. So I'm just gonna take you guys on the adventure with me because it's a brand new day. So, yeah. What did you get, Mom? Banana Fosters uh -huh. with uh, bacon, apple, smoked apple, wood bacon. Okay. <laughs> you got fresh fruit and then I I got classic fruit. Our new, our new whip. Yeah, we don't really, we just look. Yay! Unfortunately, I'm not supposed to be taking videos, so I'm going to try to sneak videos anyways of little stuff. Because they're not going to know the difference. I could be saying I'm taking pictures. Uh, <laughs> but we're inside the elevator. We have a whole like little tour guide and everything to the elevator. Taylor Swift's little I didn't even see the car. So much more on the third floor. Look at these old cars. So this is Johnny Cash's jacket and the Elvis Presley. This is actually Elvis Presley's gold coated Cadillac. It's 
So cool. And it's like a little studio. <laughs> and Corey's in there singing. I think I made a platinum record in that bit. <laughs> we just left the museum and I can only give a sneak peek of like little stuff. But we went to the little gift shop because the first floor is the gift shop and they knew what they were doing leading us down from the third floor to the second floor to the first floor for the gift shop. And me and my mom almost bought the whole store, I'm not gonna lie. Mom, show me your pink guitar. Look at her cutest little pink guitar. <laughs> there were so many cute things and I even seen these cute little earrings as well which were like um, little cowboy hats and they were like cow print. They're so cute. Um, but yeah, it was nice. It was a good experience for sure. I would definitely recommend everybody to go to it. The people were super duper nice in there and out here in general. Like everybody says, sorry, oh excuse me, thank you. Uh, yes sir, yes ma'am, no ma'am, no sir. Things like that, it's just so respectful out here. The driving is so much better than Houston. They think that their traffic is bad. Babe, it adds 30 extra minutes on in Houston. Yours only added two. Yes. And they let you over, they let you cross the street. It's just crazy out here, it's crazy different. But I'm really enjoying the experience so far. It's super duper fun, super duper cool. Would definitely recommend everybody to come to Nashville for sure, because there's so much to do. Like, everybody thinks there's nothing to do out here, but there's so much to do compared to what we have back home. So we are at the Trap House place. It's kind of small on the inside, and they don't have that many options. as far as like a bunch that you can choose from. It's literally just a burger and wings that you can get max. Of course, the fries are crispy. As soon as it comes out, I'm gonna let y'all know how it tastes and what it looks like at the end. So. The fries just taste like potato with a little bit of Tony's on it. No, it tastes like it's special. Okay, let's just burn it. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool. Okay guys, we are walking that way. We just got dropped off. We're going to ride the scooters tonight because I know my feet gonna hurt up in these boots. I wore these to the rodeo two years ago. Oh my God, they tore my feet up. I was like swollen and everything. Look at the sign. Can you read the sign? What? <laughs> Dick? <laughs> the sign in front of us, girl. Coyote ugly. I see your shirt.
Like it's moving around through the chair off this building? Stay close. It's crazy to be out here. We're about to be on our way to brunch. The wait is two hours, but it's not like we have much of a choice. So I'm gonna look for other food places just in case in the area, but it's super duper busy. Like it was packed on the inside. Okay, so I got ice strawberry matcha. So I got the strawberry croissant. It's okay. Yeah, it's not nasty. I'm about to eat it and demolish it because it's actually pretty good. What's up, y'all? We currently shopping for new suitcases, you know what I'm saying? Show y'all what we looking at right now. So. We're looking at this model right here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But in silver, not the rose gold. In silver, yeah. So we ended up not eating at that Buttermilk Ranch place because it was a two hour wait. We were waiting, we walked around a little bit and it was just, it became unreasonable to sit there and wait for a whole another hour. So we ended up going to that Nashville Street Tacos. I got the quesadillas. It was literally just food. There was nothing special about it. It wasn't just, oh my God, this is so good. Down here really reminds us of back home at Montrose. Um, because it's just a bunch of like little shops and stuff. Like, I think in Montrose they have like Salt Life and. You want to ride thing. the bull? What? That's a <laughs> that's a bison. <laughs> Can't even move it. No, right? That doesn't make sense. Have Draper James down here too. And we made it to the store that I wanted to come to. It's so cute on the outside. I'm gonna go inside and show y'all the inside. That drive felt so long, like the longest ever. And me and Corey took a nap. It felt like a really long nap. I know y'all not 
<laughs> Look at our board and our wine. So cute. What is that? Yeah, I don't know what's on this plate. It's like a different. These are like different cheeses. Are these grapes? Those don't look like no, grapes. These are looks like olives. I don't want that shit. They have like the little caramel. I eat a pretzel. Okay, let's try the fruit wine first. Okay. Let's put the fruit one back. This is a Chardonnay. Let's see if the Chardonnay is okay. You wanna try one? This one's not as bad as the first one. The Chardonnay, you might like that one a little bit. Yeah, this one tastes better. This one is going to be cherry cola, wild berries, and a hint of Tennessee whiskey. That one nasty. This is ant I didn't even try it yet. Antebellum red. All dark stuff that look like that be mad. I would drink. Nothing. Gonna put that one back. This is Red Fox Red. Double red. This one's okay. I wouldn't drink it again. So out of all four, I would drink the Chardonnay again. The rest of them, I would not ever touch those again in my life. <laughs> I'll drink all four of them again in my life. Pretty nasty. <laughs> Demonstrate it for us again. Look at that. May I have another one? <laughs> We're finally back home <sighs> and tired. Corey just took off my boots. I'm gonna take a little nap and figure out what we're eating later. That's all I got. Am I going to Baskin Robbins? And we're definitely going to Baskin Robbins because there's one right across the street. So it's like a two minute walk. Uh, but that's all. So whenever we wake up or whatever we end up doing, I'll update everybody then. Mm -hmm. Good morning, vlog. So we're officially back home. We're back here at home, and the weather is disgusting out here. It's raining, and it's just nasty, and it's humid, and it's just gross. Really, really hungry. It is currently ten o'clock. Lock the doors. Just got back into Lexi. Beautiful, beautiful Lexi. The only thing I missed was my car. That's it. Because we couldn't drive the whole time being out there. And Salem. And Salem. I miss my baby. Oh, yeah. We're going to be in the road awakening. <laughs> <laughs> Missing Salem. But, yeah. So, Nashville was super duper fun. Um, it was so packed on a Friday. Definitely a 10 out of 10 experience, though. Um, I can't even imagine what a Saturday looks like because a Friday was super duper crazy out there on Broadway But we still had fun and we chilled and everything like that. So it was super nice One thing I noticed is that the highways were super clean compared to ours Like I didn't see any trash on the highways. Our highways are disgusting. There's nothing but trash and the people were super nice and friendly. We didn't really have any like rude encounters with anybody. Yeah, overall trip was good, 10 out of 10. Everybody really enjoyed themselves. Now it's back to reality, um, but that's all. Okay, bye.